Hello and welcome to day 81 of our 2790 series. Today we're going to be uh, beginning 1st John, the first of three letters. Uh, the beginning of the letter, the first part of it, it's pretty clear that uh, John feels that he has to defend his authority as a disciple. It seems obvious now that people are wondering if these stories that these men are telling are true. They're questioning the veracity of the truth of their telling these stories. And so John begins his letter by saying, I was there. Uh, listen to what I saw and I heard. I touched these things. I handled the truth. I was there. And so he believes that his physical presence, his experience in walking with Jesus Christ should legitimize the truth. But in fact, uh, someone else's experience of the truth doesn't necessarily make it true for anyone else uh, other than the person who lived it and walked it and breathed it. And so then he begins to relate to them uh, that maybe his changed life would be sufficient evidence that he's now a completely new person. And then he begins to encourage them to become like him and walk in the light, he says. Become children of the light. And he says the chief evidence of the transformation in his life and in the life of a disciple is love. That they would love God, not for any other reason than that he simply first loved us. That they would walk in the light even as Jesus is in the light and that they would love one another. And so he begins to share with them that there is evidence for transformation, and he calls all believers to live lives of holiness. Enjoy the beginning of 1 John.